And we begin with that huge gift to the University of Houston. We are talking about $20 million to be exact. Thank you for joining us. I'm Andy Sirota. And I'm Jennifer Reyna. There will also be a vote over whether to rename the Hoffines Pavilion. Our Kathy Hernandez was there. And Kathy, such a big day for U of H. That's right, U of H says Fertitta's donation is a big step forward in helping with the $60 million renovation of Hoffine's Pavilion. Hoffine's Pavilion is nearly 50 years old. The university believes the renovation will give it a competitive advantage and a push toward entering the Big 12 Conference. U of H says the sports facility would be named the Fertitta Center and it'll feature a club area and courtside club. The school would transform an area near the arena into Hoffines Plaza and ask the city to rename a portion of Holman Street after the Hoffines family. What an honor this is for me today to be able to take this facility and take it to the next level. When there was somebody that when I was 8, 10, 11 years old and, and had such an impact on me. But times have changed. We realize that and we know that if our father were alive today, that he would be supportive of this project with great enthusiasm. He was a great booster of the university. We know he would, he would agree that the name change would be necessary to bring the university to the next level of excellence. And construction would start after this upcoming basketball season and be ready for play in the 2018-2019 basketball season. The Board of Regents is expected to vote on the name tonight. Reporting live on the U of H campus, Kathy Hernandez, KPRC, Channel 2 News.